Hello, Tim from Fair Play Now. On the 15th of July, 2021, do you know what? I really, really, really thought I was gonna get away with it. I really did. What do I mean by getting away with it? Well, when, when you're sort of into history like I am to a certain extent, as I think many, many people who watch this channel are as well, you kind of get a bit of an understanding of how people have lived throughout the ages. And it's got to be said that if you kind of were born anywhere from sort of 1940s onwards, up until just very recently, uh, life has been good. Certainly way, way, way better than it would have been had you been born a lot earlier in, in times. And I think I saw somewhere that uh, uh, the average Roman only lived to 28 years old. I mean, honestly, just imagine that. Uh, in the Middle Ages, I think average life expectancy was 35 to 40. And even uh, as recently as sort of late Victorian times or early 20th century, I think again, average life expectancy was only about 50, if that. So we're living a lot, a lot longer and also our lives are obviously a lot more comfortable and convenient. Again, you only have to go back 100 years or not even 100 years and lots and lots of people in the UK and other uh, sort of Western world countries would often go very, very hungry uh, indeed and sort of have to sort of miss quite a few meals before getting their uh, next bite to eat. And whereas now we haven't really ever had to uh, worry about empty stomachs and we haven't had to worry about things being uncomfortable. We've got nice warm houses, nice dry houses, air conditioned houses if you're in a hot country. I and mean, kings would have given their right arm to live in the average three bedroom semi detached house. Uh, kings from sort of the Middle Ages. They would have, um, like someone like Henry VIII would have said, yeah, you, you can have Heaver Castle, give me your modern three-bed semi. Uh, yeah, they wouldn't have been that impressed with the space and the decor, but they'd have been amazed with the central heating, uh, the electricity and all the devices, and the sort of fresh, clean, running water, apart from the fluoride, maybe, uh, and all the other conveniences of modern life. And until recently, I thought that was going to continue. I know I'm in my late fifties now, and I can probably reasonably, reasonably expect another twenty years, maybe a bit more, with a bit of luck and a following wind. And because I did have this feeling in my twenties that we're living in sort of the best of times. And how long can it continue? It can't continue forever. And there's been other civilizations which have been sort of almost paradise on earth to, to live in. And yet they've collapsed. And I guess the people who were left over uh, sort of faced very dire circumstances indeed. But I honestly thought, yeah, another 20 years and I'll get away with it. I will be sort of one of the lucky ones in history who has just managed to live a life of reasonable or relative prosperity, comfort and happiness. Now, you might have seen my earlier video today about all about prepping because I've now got to the viewpoint where it may not be the case that I sort of managed to live out the entirety of my life in in comfort. You know, the last sort of 20 years might be tough, might be very tough. And yeah, it's a shock to the system when, you know, I just thought I'd be working maybe another sort of five or 10 years and then sort of at least semi-retire or then fully retire and just 
have a nice little retirement uh, doing whatever before sort of you know going up and meeting my maker but yeah it does kind of look like there might be a few sort of hard years coming up so and I don't know yeah like I said I thought really thought I was going to get away without having to see anything like that and to be fair if kind of things do get back to some semblance of normality whatever normality is going to be in future and things aren't too bad for the next 20 30 years to see me out uh, I guess you could say you know I did pretty much get away with it yeah there's a, a little bit of a blip sort of in around 2020 and 2021 but overall my life wasn't too bad at all but yeah I mean, who knows now, what's the point of this video and I guess the point is is you know I've got a lot of things to be grateful for but also a lot of things to sort of think about and to prepare for so this is just tying in with my prepping video from earlier on it's a good idea to prep and it's a good idea to really learn as much as possible about kind of survival and about uh, prepping and about being resilient in the coming times so really really this was just a brain dump really but yeah I thought I was going to get away with it not so sure I am now but we'll see Tim from Fairplay now thanks for watching